Welcome to this week's Walther Showroom Update. I'm Zach, and just today Walther's announced a brand new set of HO scale kits from Cornerstone in a brickwork series. This is a great trackside industry that now you can model in HO scale. We're going to show you the uh, the models that we're using to create the package photos, and we're going to do that right now. Right, so this new series makes it real easy to model a trackside brickworks in HO scale. And the kits model prototype buildings as they were seen from the 1880s through the 1990s. The first kit to show you today is this brick kiln, which actually comes as a two-pack, and it, it includes two kiln structures, as the one seen here, this exhaust stack, some brick stacks, and some pallets. Um, and the kiln itself can be modeled either for earlier eras with the coal firing uh, that was used, or for later eras when the kilns were gas-fired. The later modification comes by adding the gas burners and the associated piping to the exterior. And in a number of cases, the local brickworks would paint them blue like you see here on this model. The kit really has a lot of visual interest. Once you get it built up and on the layout installed, it's actually a very attractive point of interest uh, along your railroad. Next up is the Brickworks Building Kit. And this is a building where a lot of the work is done with bringing the clay in by rail, mixing and storing the clay, and then of course, all the molding operations prior to setting the bricks to the kiln. It's a medium-sized building that comes with a brick smokestack and some brick stacks and pallets for the surrounding scenery. All right, so the final kit is this brickwork storage building, which was used for staging and storing the bricks prior to loading them up, uh, either on rail or to road trucks as well. And so this is where all the logistics work takes place. The sheds like these were originally constructed in the 1920s, maybe the 1930s, and they lasted for decades. They're modeled with a realistic look of corrugated siding, and with some good weathering techniques, it can really become an attractive piece on your layout. So like the other two kits, this kit also includes brick stacks and pallets for the surrounding scenery, and of course, brickworks like this would have had gobs of bricks just laying around on these stacks. Um, so we've created brick stacks uh, as a kit for that purpose as well. The kit gets you about twice as many bricks and pallets as you see here uh, for about 20 bucks, offering the ability to really fill in the scene. And just real quick, I'm going to spin this around so that you can see the truck bumpers on the opposite side for road trucks. Okay, so like I mentioned at the top of the show, this is actually the first day that these are being announced. So if you want to get some more information, you can visit us at walters.com. We've got a lot more information and pictures there to show you. Uh, and if you're interested, let your hobby shop know. Let your local hobby shop know. They can place some orders, bring them into stock. It's a great classic trackside industries model of HO scale. So that's our show for this week. Thank you very much for joining me. Come back in two more weeks, and I promise you, two more weeks from now, we'll have those Jordan spreaders here ready to show you.